Hey, I will talk about fabric paint. What to consider when buying it, how to apply it and how to wash the painted clothing. Today I will show you fabric paint that is usually sold in jars and should be applied with a brush or a sponge. First I advise you to take time. It will take at least two days but it's good to plan it for a week. Especially if you want a long lasting result. First you should wash the newly bought clothes. This gets rid of all the softening and anti-wrinkling chemicals. The color will stick better to clean fabric. Every step in the process can take a considerable amount of time. Ironing the clothes after washing, painting, painting the paint to dry and ironing the painted clothes to make the color stick can take a while. Expect it to take many days to avoid unnecessary rushing. Please read the product label of your paint jar of how to properly set the colors. If you want to buy the fabric paint uh, from the shop near you, you should start uh, purchasing the paint first, because it will dictate you what fabric you can use. Read the product label. You can use up to 5% of synthetic fabric from some colors, but some allow it to be up to 20% synthetic. If you order the paint online, you will have wider options, but you still should watch out for the color suitability for the fabric you have. A natural material like cotton will absorb the paint better, so I recommend using 95-100% to cotton cloth. Then you can't go wrong with a fabric choice. When buying the paint, you should think about the tone of the fabric you want to color. Some are suitable for light cloth and some for dark cloth. Usually the paint that is meant for light fabric is not suitable for dark fabric. Here you can see a light shirt and a dark shirt that I colored with the same paint. You can see everything on the light fabric. But on the dark shirt you can only see the colors meant for dark cloth. This red color here is exactly the same as here. The red paint meant for light fabric doesn't look as bright on the dark fabric. But this yellow covering paint works well on both. Every brand has its own way of making if the paint is meant for dark or light fabric. For example, Creu Leona has a dark label for dark cloth and a light label for light cloth. Marabu Textile is suitable for light fabric and may not be visible on dark cloth. But Marabu Textile Plus is a coating paint and works on both dark and light material. Bebeo has light fabrics making on the label and colors for dark cloth are marked as opaque. And for those brands I have covering paint, so these work well with dark fabric. Now you might think, why aren't they all covering paints suitable for both dark and light material? The difference is in the texture. You can feel the covering paint under your finger. It feels like acrylic paint. The colors meant for light fabric are fully absorbed and you can't feel it under your fingers. It is a good idea to cover the working surface with something like newspapers. For this example I will color this shirt. It is 95% cotton and 5% elastan. And it is very important to put a protective sheet of paper between the two layers if you are painting a bag, shirt or a dress. It prevents the colors from the top layer from leaking to the bottom. You can use many different techniques to apply the paint. I use something very simple. I am using tape, sponge and brushes.
Now I let it dry for a couple of days and then use her iron to heat set the colors. The shirt has dried and is ready for ironing. I will set it to the correct temperature and will iron it without steam. It is necessary to put a thin sheet of cotton on top of the image. Now I will iron about 30 times 30 cm area, both sides about 3 minutes. You can read from the product label how long you should iron it. And it's done! This is a very easy to use technique that everyone can do. It is a simple way to turn some boring cloth into something more interesting. Add a message or make them match with other clothing accessories. Items colored with fabric paint will last longer if you set your washing machine to delicate. Set the temperature to 30 degrees centigrade and spin cycle to 600 rpm. Let it dry naturally by hanging. It would be better to wash them by hand, but I have used a washing machine. Like and subscribe. Leave a comment if you have a question or want to leave some feedback. Thank you for watching and good luck with painting.